Thank you for visiting Pro Wrestling this week on our official YouTube page. Please make sure to subscribe to our page and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any updates from our channel. Also make sure you tell us what you think of this video in the comment section below. Unfortunately. I'll tell you what as well, I was at Survivor Series. Amazing match with Thank Charlotte you. Flair. Of course, had all the intrigue around it, the hysteria. Do you think that match helped your relationship in a, in a weird way? With her? Yeah. Like you get to no. go out there and make magic? No, it doesn't uh, matter. I don't, I don't know. I think, I think we're always going to be synonymous with each other's careers, but I don't think... Um, I, I, I don't like the way she does things. I don't like the way she does business, and uh, and I'm pretty sure she doesn't like me either. So it's a uh, it's a it's a mutual relationship. Maybe one day when we're both retired and we can look back and go, hey, well, we freaking changed the game. That was pretty cool. Um, but but right now, right now, I think it's always going to be like this. Yeah, because you had a lot of emotion coming after that match, right? Yeah. You know, backstage. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. Because it's you know, you talk about years of friendship and and coming up together and having a similar dream and a similar vision and, and there's so much love and you've been through so much and you've survived things together. Like, I mean, literally survived sure. things together. And so to go from that to then just pure hatred and wanting to tear each other apart, it's sad. It's really, it's really sad when you see a friendship dissolve like that in a manner like that, especially when it's, it doesn't feel necessary, you know? Yeah. And so, yeah, so, so there was a lot of emotion involved. Speaking of emotion, I'm hearing that Triple H spoke to you guys yesterday. Yeah. How wonderful was that to see him in the flesh? Oh, it was amazing, man. I, I choked up. My husband did too. It, it was incredible. I think we all missed him. He's been such a part of, of all of our journey. And he's been, especially for us, for the women, he's been such a champion for us and really has allowed um, us to evolve in the way that we have and be able to tell stories in the way that we have and change the game and change the business. And now, as a, as a mother of a little girl, she can look at us and... You know, she can know that, well, hell, anything's possible. If I want to do that, I won't be relegated to, oh, when, when I came in, which wasn't too long ago, women couldn't punch. Mm. They couldn't punch. I was told I couldn't punch. I had to move more like a girl. What the hell does that mean? I'm a girl and I'm moving, you know? And so and so there is no limits. There is no limits anymore. And that's awesome. And that is hugely thanks to Triple H. The girl who failed PE had to move more like a girl. Yeah, yeah. I mean, look, I didn't, I didn't fail PE for moving like a girl. I failed PE for not moving. Are you Team Becky or Team Charlotte? Do you want to see a match built up between Becky and Charlotte for a future pay-per-view or premium live event? Let us know in the comment section below. And thanks for watching this video on pro wrestling this week. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any updates. Also follow us on Facebook at Pro Wrestling This Week or on Twitter at Pro Wrestling TW.